Hello everyone. This uh, next video, I'm going to be looking at this today. I've been looking at the Lego uh, flower bouquet arrangements for a while, uh, but I found this on Amazon for about half the price, and uh, I thought I'd check it out uh, just to brighten up the room a little bit. Uh, you can see uh, if you look at the back here, it says there's one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine or so flowers in here. One of the reasons I actually bought this one is because it comes with this vase. But now I'm thinking, judging by the size of the box, well, it's probably a piece of cardboard that is concertinaed into a holder for these actual flowers. But we'll see. I'll open it up now. My oh my, I haven't done Lego in quite a while, but I'm hoping it's going to be a little bit more straightforward than the Metal Earth puzzles that I've been doing. One, two, three, four, five, as I suspected. Oh, a bit of cardboard that's in a sort of like uh, concertina sort of style. You will make it turn to a vase. Some other additional bits, another pack, and the instructions. That's it. That's all that's in the box. Let's have a look. So, a nice flower bouquet build building kit. Let's put that to the side. Oh, look at this. Yeah. I mean, this it has got a brick separator in here. Oh, there's the vase instructions, how to create that. Could be okay, could be terrible. Let's, uh, let's have a look how many packs there are in total. One, two, three. Four, five, six, and I guess these are additional stems that we want to use. Not really sure. Anyway, it's uh, I think in this video I'm going to do a time lapse and a pause and discuss each flower as I uh, as I make it. All right, let's do this. Well, that's done. Uh, I learned I don't know how to tie a ribbon. So that's why I need these instructions here. It's <laughs> pointless. But um, as you can see here, there's tags. One, two, and one underneath. That basically hold this all together, which is uh, one in here. So four in total, a little bit fiddly, but um, a bit of given here. I have a feeling that I might have to remove the ribbon later on, depending on the thickness of the the flowers, but as suspected, it's cardboard. I guess from a distance it'll do, but um, let's put this to the side and move on to the actual flowers. So here we go, this is the first flower done. You can see there's articulation here on each one of these petals. Um, 
There's also a, a certain level of articulation at this joint here. It's kind of coolish. Uh, there's a ball joint on the pedal, so you can put. Oh, there you go. But um, for what it is, I mean, from a distance, I could see how that could look kind of cool. Um, yeah, that's it's quick. What, less than 15 minutes or so to make one flower. Move on to the next one. Okay, flower number two. All right, the stem and petal uh, leaf, same as before. This flower was kind of a little bit of annoying. These little uh, Lego pieces that thread onto these kind of stem type things. These uh, have a tendency to pop off. At some one point, I was thinking about gluing them on, but with 30 of these flowers, I'm like, eh. If it comes off now, too bad. But otherwise, once again, Looks fairly busy from a distance, colourful. Yeah, it's alright. Okay, so the third flower done. Once again, so uh, it doesn't look too bad. It's a bit thinner, small flowers. Oh. Once again, articulated over the next, one stem is slightly shorter than the other, which I guess will look good in the in the vase or for its for aesthetic purposes. But I mean, for so many stems here, I could change that to, to suit my purpose. But uh, on to the next one. Couple of quick ones they didn't uh, take too long and the stem here as you can see very flexible so not like the rigid stems on the uh these flowers for instance this is kind of a little bit more uh i guess they'll droop or drape from the vase but uh all right next Okay, so I didn't even realize that these were done until I started on the next stem. So I guess the, these are kind of flowers, not really sure. I guess it's just filler, really. But um, yeah, that one's done. Once again, a very flexible stem. So let's have, we'll see how that looks. exactly the same type of uh, build as the pink roses so that didn't really take too long to make
flour, whichever. And, uh, and that's it. Those are all the all of them. Those are all the flowers. So I'm gonna come back. Uh, I'm gonna put them, arrange them in the vase, and then uh, let you have a look at them. But it was um, maybe an hour or two to build all of this. It wasn't that long at all. It's quite pleasant. Uh, all the pieces. The only one that was quite difficult was this one because the the small uh, flowers was sometimes pop off as you might have seen the time lapse. I was just fiddling with this one quite a bit. It was kind of annoying. I was tempted to glue at one point as I said. But um, yeah, until next time.